Hi, I'm John from HeatAddicts.com. And I'm Julia. And today we're going to be reviewing our second sauce that we've reviewed from T. Mutter. He's a hot pepper grower in Florida, like makes some sauces. He made the holiaki that we reviewed a few months ago. So good. Yeah, that was some really good stuff. <laughs> really good. But now we're reviewing scorched steak sauce. Ooh. You know, like me, I'm a huge, huge fan of A1 steak sauce. Like I love, yeah, I love steak sauce. Like I just... Looking at a bottle of A1, my mouth waters. So doing a review of a spicy steak sauce sounds like a good time to me. Sounds like a party. Sounds like an awesome idea. It, indeed. <laughs> well, you want to read off the ingredients? All right. So tonight's ingredients are roasted seven pod brown peppers, tomato paste, coffee, Worcestershire, molasses, garlic, onion, malt vinegar, dry mustard, brown sugar, Szechuan peppercorns, sea salt, gum, and liquid smoke. Sounds pretty good. Sounds pretty interesting. Yeah, yeah. you know I like the smoky sauces. Um, but anyway, color. tonight the color, it's definitely like a dark brown, probably because of the coffee. There's little specks in there. I think specks. it could be the peppers. It and could everything. be the peppercorns that that are in there. Could be coffee bits. Who knows? But um, it looks, it has a smoky kind of a chipotle kind of color to it. Well, we like, we like and, and they're deep, roasted too. They're roasted seven pod brown peppers. flavor color. Yeah. I know those are those are and some seriously hot peppers. Seven. Yeah, they're they're yeah. hot hot peppers. We like the seven pods, so um, and it's sure got it's, it's got brown sugar and molasses, so it's like a Ooh. double dose of uh, brown sugar Little goodness, su extra sweetness. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a good time. Mm -hmm. I'm hungry. I'm just staring at the bottle. <laughs> Yeah, we, uh, we spent the entire day. day cleaning our place, getting it all fixed up and ready to go. And, uh, yeah, yeah we're, we're beat, we're famished, and we're not really in the mood to cook, so we just ordered some food from Papa John's up the street. Awesome little takeout dine-in place. So if you're ever in the area, check them out. Awesome subs and pizzas and all that good stuff. Oh, you can smell that liquid smoke coming off yeah. of it, too. You can smell the Worcestershire, the sweetness of the brown sugar. Like hint, it's Ooh, like a smoky yeah. barbecue sauce a little bit. I mean, definitely, it's definitely smell the liquid smoke. Yeah, it has a has a smoky barbecue smell to it. Mm -hmm. It it mm. I'm sure it'll be awesome. It's nice and thick. I'm excited. I'm just hungry. <laughs> Anything food, I'm just staring at. Like, <laughs> all right. Definitely a thicker consistency, as John said. It has a lot of different See, little the, bits going on in here. It's got it's about, about the same Smells thickness. Smells amazing. As, it's about the same thickness as like you know regular A one. No, A one's a little, a little bit thinner, a little bit runnier. At me. least in my opinion, this is a little bit thicker. Which. I love the thicker sauces. Oh. They actually stick to your food a little bit better. Oh, it's but, definitely, um, it definitely smells sweet. I hope it's, I hope it's nice and spicy though. All right, well, let's, let's put get it down to this. this. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. 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 hitting the back of the throat it's not it's not like it's a super ridiculous burn but no I'm definitely feeling I'm, it I'm thrown back by act like how hot this really is I wasn't really expecting it to be this warm or yeah. to hit me so quickly um, oh man this is gonna be good on our burger sauce. I was kind of you know chewing you can definitely um, taste the little peppercorn bits mm -hmm. um, you know, Definitely it's, I mean, it's smoky. Sure. It's yeah, very yeah. smoky. So if you like those smoky sauces like I do, you're you will definitely enjoy this. Ooh man. Ooh man. Kinda, it's, it's getting yeah, a little hard for me to talk bit. just a little bit, but um oh man, this is first impression. I'm Two definitely impressed. Yeah, right now, for yeah sure. it definitely does have a steak sauce feel. It has a nice little burn mm -hmm. to go along with it. Mmm, just that liquid smoke. Just that oh. The smoke. But it, it it also kind of reminds me a little bit of a barbecue sauce. Yeah. Like I can see, because of the sweetness of the brown sugar and the molasses. Yeah, it's definitely into the Worcestershire sweet. In there. Yeah, it's a sweet, smoky. I can see this smothered on a steak or pretty much anything steak beef. <laughs> yeah, Ste it's gonna go on our steak fries too. Mm. Oh my goodness. Yummy. Well, so, uh, what do you think right now for you know heat level? I'm saying it's about a seven, seven heat. 
I'm going to give it a 7.5. I'm a little thrown back by how hot it was. I wasn't expecting it. Yeah. But um, it, it's it's a fair amount of heat in my opinion. It does. I mean, it's a, it is a decent burn. It's definitely one of the hotter ones that we've tried recently. Mm -hmm. um, flavor, yeah. what are you saying? I'm, I'm thinking 8.5 to Eight. start. Yeah, I have to agree. You can taste a lot of different things, a lot of different mm -hmm. ingredients in there. It's not like the front of my tongue has a sweetness, but the sides of my tongue have like a peppercorn. Yeah, there's that lingering peppery lingering flavor. Lingering heat to it. So every time I swallow, I get a little different bits of of mm. the of the sauce. So it's it's good. The so spot in the I think that's and, and aroma. I mean, it has a really nice sweet smell to it. So definitely. Mm. I mean, I'd say about eight five. Like it, it, it's definitely pleasing. It's not, you know. Yeah. It's it, it's definitely hitting the spot so far, and I am anxious for our food to get here. <laughs> so we are gonna let you guys go for a few while we wait for the delivery guy. We're gonna stop and, you know, wait for him to show up. Yes. Hope they honk soon. Yeah, because we are starving. <laughs> so we will check you guys here in a few. See you guys later. All right, and we're back. We've got ourselves a cheeseburger sub from Bob and John's, and some steak fries, and we got the steak sauce smothered on there. Oh yeah. Well, since you Excellent. know, yeah, you want to take the very first bite? Oh, I'm gonna actually got to put mine sure. back together. Mmm, I'm excited to try this. Oh, I bet it's gonna be good. You can do it, John. Mmm. There we go. Mmm. Mm. No, this yeah, this sauce like I uh, just tried a little bit more of it. In, while we were waiting for the food, and it's definitely got a nice lingering burn to it. Like it's got that seven pot burn. Mm -hmm. Those things are those things definitely kick you in the teeth a little bit. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Have a good time. Mm hmm. Mm. That was my turn for the very first bite. Yes, a cheeseburger sub. It's genius. <laughs> Okay, I think I can talk now. I was just so hungry. It tasted so good. I stuffed myself as you could, as you just saw. But um, mm. I will say that it, when you have it on food, especially on the cheeseburger sub, it has a more barbecue flavor to it. At least to me, this the molasses and the sweetness. It's really coming out it for is, me. It is very, very mm -hmm. sweet now mm -hmm. on this. Yeah, but I, I have to agree with John. Um, it definitely has a creeping, lingering heat and definitely a mm. trait of the seven pod. But um, man, it's good. I love the, the smokiness to the sauce. Yeah, you do. Yeah, that liquid smoke, genius mm -hmm. to add that to it. really totally. sets everything else off in this sauce. Mm -hmm. All in all, I'm really, really impressed by this. Mm. You know what? Oh, oh, we got steak fries. We gotta mm. try them with the steak sauce. Mm -mm -mm. A little bit for your fry? Please. That stuff is so good. I mean, the front of my bottle. lips, the front of my lips mm. are are heated a little bit. Has a nice little tingle. Tip of my tongue. That's good. Like, it's that's, good. Yeah, that's I a good really, steak sauce. I really, really enjoyed the steak sauce. Mm. This is awesome. I think it could have multiple purposes beyond just a steak sauce, but this is great. I, I love it. This, you know, like, a, generally, like, I, any dish involving beef, I could see this being utilized. Mexican yeah. food, I could see it being added mm -hmm. to that. Mm -hmm. Just because of just how sweet it is, it can, it, it I, I can see it being suitable for other meals but the the pepper the pepper flavor of it oh, yeah. i love the addition of the peppercorns i love peppercorns at, at, you know on mm. salads i you name it wherever i can have it i'm probably going to go for it so i think that was a really good choice um i like biting on the peppercorn bits a little bit so you get a little extra zing to the nose yeah, it's definitely good it's, it's good mm -hmm. good call yeah, everything in this definitely hit the spot for us uh, mm -hmm. Thank you, Todd, for sending this to us. Sorry it yes, took us so long you. to get around to doing the review. We got oh, a little bit backed up, but this is, we're, we're really impressed. <laughs> and I mean, really, I don't really know what else to say. I didn't say really a whole lot more. Yeah. I'm saying on food, it's a nine. Like, yeah, I have to say on food, it, it definitely like went it, up it, a, it, a little bit. It's a little bit better. Like it, it, mm -hmm. it, it's a good sauce by itself, but it is a little bit better on food. Mm -hmm. um, 
you know, the, the aroma on food, I don't say it really, don't think it really improves much. It's still no, about the same. Very, yeah, I But it's, it, it's, it's a good sauce. Like, mm -hmm. I want to try more. Me too. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. So I think our rating is pretty much the same. What, 8, 5 on heat, even on food. Oh, wait, no, we said 8 on heat. Yeah, it's Seven, a 9 five, for eight. flavor. Yeah. yeah, I'd say it's a 9 flavor. Like, it's nine a really good flavor. flavor. It, 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 if you like steak sauce, you know, you know, you'll like this. And you love, well, if you love spicy food. If you don't like spicy food, it might be a little bit too much for it. <laughs> but if you do and you love steak sauce, thumbs up indeed. No. Awesome. Well, on that note. All right. Oh, actually, what? No. I'm hungry. Let's I'm go. I'm hungry. Yeah, we're going to dig into the food. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're getting a little bit delirious because we are starved from all the cleaning that we've yeah, done today. Yeah, so. it's been a long day, so we're going to chow down now. Yeah, we're going to let you guys go. We'll have many more reviews to come in the following year. Have right. a good one. Keep it saucy. Keep it saucy.